everybody, it's me, Aisha, aka Unapologetically Aisha Black with another vlog. I am on my way to the city market. I have been super obsessed with the city market here lately because one, since I went, I well, this is not the first time I went, but it's the first time in a long time. I have been obsessed with like the fresh veggies because I literally could tell the difference between store-bought produce and um farmers market produce clearly it's fresher but it just tastes better and makes my body feel great so i am on my way back to the city market i'm gonna get some produce and probably go get some beignets i'm obsessed with them beignets anyways um i went ugly why you always look mad why is your skin glowing <laughs> Listen, he don't do no skincare regimen. Men don't have to try. I'm telling you, look, his skin look like he. Listen, he got a natural highlight. I had to. Anyways, I see y'all at the city. Hey, everybody, I'm back at home. So I decided not to vlog my day at the city market because I've already vlogged that. And plus, we do have a lot. We did have a lot to do. We dropped my mom off at his grandma's house, my mom's house, just so we can uh, run a couple errands. So, we're definitely finished grocery shopping. We did some at the city market. We got a lot of our produce there. And then I also got a lot of, I did some at the city market. I got a lot of my produce there. And then I also went to Aldi's just to pick up a couple things that I needed. Um, so, I'm just going to show you guys what I got from the city market. Um, yep, here I go. So as you guys can see, I didn't get that much, but I did get a lot for what I paid for. So altogether, I feel like I paid $30. No, like literally I paid $30 for everything. So these, around $30 let's say. So these two asparagus heads, I've been really craving asparagus here lately. And uh, I'm gonna make some really nice dishes with these. But Trent likes these too. Um, what he ate, he ate a little bit of it, but I'm really trying to introduce a lot of greens to his diet. So if you guys have any like suggestions on like introducing greens to toddlers diets, um, cause I do it in smoothies, but I really want him to eat salad. Um, so if you just guys have any comments or any suggestions, just comment down below and I'll definitely try it. Cause like I said, I want him to have greens. So I got some asparaguses. I also got, it looks like two um, purple um, onions and four yellow onions. So I don't like white onions for some reason. I just feel like um, yellow onions are sweeter and purple onions just give it that like, I don't like that savory taste. So I like pepper, uh, purple and yellow onions. So that's what I got. So all together, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I got seven um, onions. So I'm gonna put that to use. You can literally put onions in anything. These were 75 cents. Me and Trent don't eat a lot of it, but he does like when I just like, um, you know like how you make baked potatoes? You just cut them down, uh, poke holes in them, put them in the oven, roast it, and then um, he likes the little agave on it or like honey, and then I'll just give it to him like that. I have yet to, um, find vegan butter and I really want to try vegan butter so I'm kind of on um I'm, I kind of haven't been eating butter in a long time and I miss it so I, I need to know where to find vegan butter probably like Whole Foods um so I'm gonna have to check it out there but that's how we eat our yams or I'll just make um sweet potato fries so but I only got four of these these were 75 cents for a pound 75 cents a pound okay Y'all know I had to pack up on bananas. So I got a big old, big old, big, 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 big box 
a bananas, three dollars. That big old box was three dollars. Then I got some um, more. They had these bananas. They were in uh, bowls, and they were basically saying like. Eat, you have to eat them as soon as possible basically so I'm gonna just put these in a freezer and I'm gonna make some like banana ice cream if you guys want the recipe for a banana ice cream just let me know uh, down below and I'll give you that recipe might as well I, I might as well just go ahead and do it because I'm gonna be doing it here pretty soon but anyways what I do is I peel these and I just put them in a freezer and so they're frozen of course and then you just put them in the blender and you can put some cacao powder like to make it like a chocolate ice cream but I just really like um, I just really like just regular just put them in and I also put dates for sweetening you can put literally anything that you want in uh, your nice cream that's what they call it nice cream they don't call it ice cream I guess because it's like healthy I don't know it's really good to me so that's what I'm gonna be doing since we have to eat them a whole uh, like really fast I'm just gonna put them in the freezer so I can savor them for a little bit longer and then put them in smoothies if I like want like smoothie bowls or anything like that bananas I got a lot of bananas cuz one that's Trenton's I feel like that's Trenton's favorite fruit two they're easy to put in like smoothie bowls to sweeten things up I feel like I'm a beginner vegan a beginner like holistic type person so I feel like so far bananas are like the easiest thing to eat for me the easiest thing to add um like when i add bananas i hate the taste of chai seeds like i don't i know it's just a seed and they pr pretty much don't have a taste um but i also hate spinach so like when i put bananas in like smoothies and i really need my greens i put like bananas to you know sweeten it up so it won't be as bad and usually bananas are overpowering so you know you don't really taste anything but bananas so i got those we're going to eat these um slowly and then the other ones i'm going to put them like i said in the freezer i also got two heads of romaine lettuce of course we can use that for anything but i'm going to use it for salad <coughs> god i'm sorry me and Trin just got over the flu influenza b that was fun that's why i'm pretty late in recording because yeah but anyways i'm gonna put uh i'm gonna make some salads um and i'm kind and i also am going to make guacamole bowls so basically you would um yeah basically these boats guacamole boats whatever they're called anyways um so you take a romaine lettuce you put guacamole in there fresh avocado whatever avocado avocado you put your whatever that you want to put in like I'm gonna put like uh, tomatoes onions put some um, celery up in there anything that you want and you just literally eat it like that I got it from a vegan uh, um, YouTube page that I'm following her name is Ellen Fisher I love her Ellen Fisher if you're watching like this video oh this is what I'm really really excited about guess how much these were y'all two dollars these will be fifteen dollars if you got them at the at the store. I got two of them because one I'm going to freeze some and for smoothies and Trenton loves blueberries, so I got them on deck. I also got some um, Romana tomatoes, two for three dollars. Two for three dollars, y'all. Check out the city market. If you want to save money, they take food stamps. We're not going to discriminate. They take food stamps, okay? Get more for your book, more for your money. If you want a budget, if you a single mom, a single dad, uh, working family, because you know they give you less benefits and less help for working families, go ahead and go to the city market. It's fresh. It's affordable. You have a walk. The environment is pretty. There's eateries. It's just a nice outing for your family or just for you. If you want some serenity, go to the city market, y'all. Like I said, y'all, it's just a quick um, grocery haul for you guys. I did not get a lot of produce, but I'm happy with what I got. I'm happy with what I spent. So thank you guys for supporting my video. Thank you guys for watching it. Like you already know. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you love me. And click the bell that you see it's a notification bell so basically you'll get notifications whenever I add a new video you'll be the first to know go ahead and support your girl go ahead and do that 
Happy Black History Month, my people. I see you guys in my next video. All right. All right. So, most of my freaking stickers are gone. But, anyways, here's the finished product when I put everything away, including the um, all these stuff. Like I said, blueberries, I put a label on them. And then the date, I'm going to freeze them. And then here are the bananas. It's so many, y'all. Like, look at that. I'm rich. All the blueberries. I need to make these broccoli. I'm going to do that today. Anyways, that's in the freezer. These are popsicles for when Trenton was sick. So don't mind me. Anyways, this is the finished. Look, I got some soy milk uh, from Audis for Trenton and I. Egg, <coughs> excuse me. I got some eggs, which is, I'm trying to really, I don't really like eggs to begin with, but Trenton loves eggs. So I'm trying to wean him off as slow as possible. So those are the eggs that I got. I usually get two, so look at me getting one. Ball my moment. Anyways, <laughs> I got some white grape juice because Trenton, that's his favorite flavor. Or one of his favorite flavors. The asparagus. Look at that. Looking all gorgeous. Sitting up there chilling. Thick. Just chilling. Anyways. I got this antioxidant power juice. It, it's 100% juice. Pomegranate. Tart cherry. Red grape. Purple carrot. Cranberry. And blueberry. I mix it with uh, spring water. And Chayton drinks it. These. I'm trying to get off of milk. But these are so good. I put these in my smoothie. And it makes it like a milky consistency. See, I'm trying to wean myself off as slow as possible. Well, no, not slow, but I'm trying to not deprive myself. So those are one of my guilty pleasures that I put in my smoothies. Not all the time, but sometimes. That are the, the blueberries. I got my baking soda to clean shit. Let me stop because my mom's watching. Clean stuff with my tomatoes looking cute. I got a couple of uh, mangoes. I already had some sweet potatoes, so that's why I didn't get a lot. And then I got some oranges from Audis. I packed up my uh, peppers. I got jalapeno peppers and green peppers and then cilantro looking nice. Here are the onions and then I just got like some water, mandarin oranges, vegetable broth because you always like <laughs> you always need that. Um, I also I'm trying this out. This is the almond milk creamer. Check me out. Caramel. It's my favorite flavor. And um, got some more blue agave. And Trenton likes these little apple and spinach, you know, the multi fruit. So I got them that. And here it is, y'all. What it is, yo. What's up? No. <laughs> All right, y'all.